Insertion sort splits the collection into two sub-collections, sorted and unsorted. The sorted sub-collection gets initialized by the first element at index 0, 10 in our example, and the unsorted sub-collection has the rest of the elements. We iterate over the elements from the unsorted sub-collection one after another and insert it in the sorted array in its sorted position. Let's watch. Now let's see how to implement insertion sort in C++. Here I have the insertion sort template. It gets first and last iterators, which represent the collection we want to sort. We have the first loop iterates over the unsorted subcollection. And the second loop iterates over the sorted subcollection. The element to insert is called unsorted. Compare the unsorted element with the sorted elements and swap if necessary. We break the loop if no swap occurs because the subcollection is sorted. And finally, we can test our insertion sort using the following code, which will execute the same steps we have seen in this video. IOTA will fill the vector from 1 to 10, Stood shuffle will shuffle the collection, and finally, we call our insertion sort algorithm. Thanks for watching.